work outside. If you go down to uh, and walk along the seawall, you'll see a beautiful mermaid in the center that's all been tiled over. That was done in the 70s. The original paintings were done by John oh. Gabriel Beckman. And then in the 1970s, they tiled over the mermaid because she was faded. The other two have not been tiled over. John Gabriel Beckman was a set designer, a little trivia. He designed the sets for Maltese, Gonka, and Casablanca. Humphrey Bogart movies. And he designed sets for I Love Lucy and Designing Women later in life. Very famous, well-known artist in California. In front of me is the Chime Tower. Chime Tower goes off every 15 minutes during waking hours. When it was originally built in 1926, it went off 24-7 every 15 minutes. They call it Westminster style. It should be going off any second. My watch is right. So they have refurbished the tower and then they're working on the balconies. Uh, unfortunately, because of COVID, all of the charitable events uh, like in London, have not been happening, so they stopped refurbishing. So if you look directly behind you, you see that one of the balconies has been done and the other balconies still need to be done. When they're completed, you'll be able to walk along the balconies as intended. So this used to be the front of the Zangre. Uh, it used to be the entrance. It was a home and then it was a hotel and then it sat in disrepair. Overseas investors came, they saw, they bought, they tore down, they rebuilt. So the new Zangre, now the entrance is in the front and of course it has an elevator, which is great. Uh, this is called the Wolf Estate. Only petting zoo on the island right there. Um, and the Wolf Estate was built by a uh, German architect in the 1920s. Huge. I would say it's close to 6,000 square feet. Yeah. Another house that sits empty, empty, empty. I've never seen anybody there. I see caretakers take care of the property, but I've never seen anybody there living there.
It was open until about five years ago, the pub. And then here was a formal dining room. It's been closed for a long time. Uh, the formal dining room and the balcony had seating out on the formal dining room, part of the uh, dining. But now it's a venue. So the venue it can be leased uh, for a special occasion, normally under normal circumstances. So that's you know, been about the last 10 years. part of the golf course. You had to be a member. This is called Five Corners. If everybody describes directions to you as go to Five Corners, this is it. Where would they be telling you to go? Well, maybe you want to come back to the Sand Trap restaurant and bar. You'd head out to Five Corners and then head to the golf course. The Sand Trap restaurant and bar has happy hour, $2 Bud Light, and $2 Sweet Tacos that are very good. It all starts at 2 p.m. It's right down the street at the end of the street is our school. The school is the Long Beach School District, which is part of LA County. This is our medical center and our hospital. Thank you. 
is all Wrigley property right here. When you look left or right, even the school, it's, it's all this company's property. So the Wrigley's in 1975 took 88% of their entire island and put it in a land trust for conservation. That left only 12% of the island for development, residential reasons, commercial reasons, 12%. Of that 12 remaining percent, the Wrigley's own and maintain 11 of them. So only 1% is anybody outside of the Wrigley Corporation, outside of this corporation. Pottery collection that's up for 